Hey YouTube, KP Fox Rider back here again with another video. Today I'm going to be going over my desk setup that I just recently put together to do some uh, gaming and college work. So yeah, I'm going to give you guys an insight on what I've got on that and we'll see where it goes. Thanks for watching guys. All right, so we'll start with the desk itself. Uh, this is an Amazon Espresso, uh, just generic desk off of Amazon. It was like $100, pretty easy to put together. It came in two days, so I'm actually pretty happy with it. It's a nice size for the price, uh, decent quality. So this should work definitely pretty well for what I needed to. It's, it's a little modern looking, so I love it. Underneath here, you can see I've uh, got LED strips underneath just to give the desk some cool LED lighting underneath of it. It's adjustable, I could change to any color or uh, rhythm, however you want it to be lit up. Down here, you can see my cable management, nothing too crazy, just a uh, Insignia power strip. It's got two USB hubs on there and then uh, four power outlets and then just all my other cables and stuff like that down there. Just, you know, it looks pretty clean. You can't see it from the top, so I'm pretty happy with that. Up top, it's pretty basic for now. I just had this desk put together so like two weeks ago, so it's not exactly how I want it yet. I still gotta get some more stuff for the setup and make it a little better and to my liking, but for now, I think it looks really nice. Just plain and simple, a little modern. So yeah, um, we'll start with the laptop. It's just an MSI GE70 uh, Apache gaming laptop. I've had it for several years now, so it, it does the job. It's nothing super amazing, but it definitely can do anything I need it to. Okay, underneath my laptop here, you can see I've got the uh, Blackhawks keyboard and mouse pad. It's got the adjustable RGB lighting all around it. It's got a button here so you can change the color or the rhythm. Like right now, it's on a breathing uh, light up. So yeah, this is really nice, super soft, easy to clean. Uh, it's good on the skin and the edge down here where the RGB strip is it doesn't really hurt or anything It is a little rough. You can see they've got some some stitching holding the RGB light in there So I mean it doesn't feel too great on the wrist, but I mean uh, I have not much to complain about it's pretty good especially for the price for only $20 I mean you really can't complain about that over here on the left side, we've got a Tautronics LED desk lamp. I've had this for several years, so hopefully I can find a link for you guys to put it down below just in case you're interested. But it's a great lamp, has three light modes and a nighttime mode that's a little bit uh, more of a yellow, dingy color. So I love that one during the nighttime when I am just have all the lights off in the house and don't want a super bright LED in my face, so that's nice. Um, below that, we've got a iPhone and iWatch charging station. So here I could charge my iWatch. It just has a charger placed in there. Put that there. That was uh, only 15 bucks on Amazon. So that's nice. I could put my phone on there and see my notifications pop up as I'm using the computer. And behind that, it's just a super, super generic um, iPhone tripod off of Amazon. It was like $8. I mean, not too bad for the price. That's super cheap, but I'll probably try to be careful with it because I'm sure it's not the most durable, but so far, I've had it for a few weeks and it's not been too bad. And over here on the right side, we've got the Thermaltake TT Esports Ventus Gaming Mouse. Uh, nothing crazy. I think I spent most like $25 on this mouse, but it is nice. You can change the weights out on the bottom of it. It's got uh, several DPI settings for however fast you want the mouse to work. So it's a good mouse. I love it. Uh, it's got like, kind of a breathable pad down here so you can, your hands don't get too sweaty. So yeah, uh, nothing crazy on that. Uh, on the right side, it's got a JBL Charge 3 portable Bluetooth speaker. I've had that for about two years now as well. Um, works great, haven't had any issues with it. Connects really fast via Bluetooth. And uh, yeah, I use that every day at work and here in the house and it's been no, no issues with that. And over here in the corner, I've got my HyperX gaming headset. This is a great headset, super nice volume. Um, comfortable leather on the sides and on top of it for your head. It actually comes with microfiber pads and the leather pads you see on there. So yeah, it just hooks up via the normal aux cord and it's got a mute switch and a volume switch here. All right guys, so that's it. That's my desk setup. 
Uh, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments. Let me know things that I could change or add to it to make it better or worse, who knows. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching and tune in for the next video. Like and subscribe and of course, share this video. Let's get it out there, get more viewers and subscribers and we'll get more videos going. Thanks guys.